man, you guys are not gonna believe this. I was adjusting my microphone for like half an hour solid. <laughs> Welcome back to the channel. We are in our cozy home. Actually, we are not. I was lying. We are in the freaking wasteland. Next to the entrance to Gravestone, which is a demon infested hellhole. And this is day 97. And you guessed it. We are one day full day away of Horde Day. Just as before. This is the day before a big Horde will come and try to kill us for sure. This is in the middle of the night. And what am I doing in, in this forsaken territory? What I'm doing is I decided to come here and spend the day before the horde trying to loot around in this wasteland. Since the last time I was here, I explored quite a bit of it. This part actually is pretty boring. I mean, I have not been down here, but th this section here is, is quite bad. The houses are almost ruined. It's full of demons and I have barely enough guns and ammunition to repel any demons. Why was I here though? I was trying to get this one. Rat pages. These will allow me to unlock weapons that can hurt the demons pretty well. Oh yeah. 40% uh, on the drone. It doesn't look good. Let me repair it. Yeah, so I had one day. My horde base is... Uh, well, not ready, but we can sort it out tomorrow. I should have enough guns and ammo to survive the horde night as usual. I'm not particularly sure about surviving this area though. Last time I was here I barely managed to survive it. And the reason being that this is all irradiated area. You see it down here I have 100% radiation protection and they also look like a, a serious researcher or something like that. Actually, no, I only have the hazmat gloves because everything else is socketed as a mod. Radiation ready mod. So I can continue using my normal clothes and I'm still protected from radiation. Um, since we have like enough time, I'm quite okay with stuff and things. I was doing a lot of quest since the last time I made a video and I also ran into a very strange bug that uh, I've never encountered before. I was uh, restarting the game and when I looked back in I came to an area which seemed like a, a, a quest area. So the one that I usually do for like lady killer quest and man eater quest and then stuff like that and uh, I had my bag that I usually drop when I die there and it was full of my stuff but I already had my stuff on me so what I got was basically a bag of all my stuff and it was a duplicate I was pleasantly surprised by that bug I'm surprised so much that I thought that I will come here and, and spend a, a little bit of time trying to explore this wasteland and search for these rat pages. Actually, since I'm here, I will drop off that one that I found because that's actually the last one that I need. I already have nine at home and with ten I mean, with the tens, 
I will be able to craft that skill book that I will need to unlock laser weapons. So that's the program for today, basically. To look around in this POI behind me that I was eyeing on, I think this is level 5 POI, so it has like a 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, you know, it's a 6 story building, and I'm pretty sure it's full of demons. I was waiting a little bit till it will be the morning, but I think we can start the, the, the beginning of it. These are risky because if I die anywhere here, I literally have to go back to my base and get another set of radiation suits. Even if I restart the game here next to my car where I put the bedroll, I will probably immediately die. I'm, I'm not even sure I will put it there. <laughs> I, I can't run fast enough for my stuff before the radiation would kill me. But yeah, let me put these two wonderful robots here. And I take out my big gun. And I and do look around here. Oh, immediately. Oh, here's somebody. Oh, yeah. He was not alone also. But we are far away from the others. Actually, I put a couple of points into stealth and sneaking. So there's a chance that even though I'm walking around here, they will not find me. But once they do, once they do, that will be horrible. So I try to be somewhat stealthy. Yeah, they will come from up there as well once they start moving. Oh, there it is. I see it from here. That's a demon there. Let me move out here and hopefully that was just one of them coming well, not even one of them i heard an explosion oh yeah there it is yeah so you see it, it takes quite a lot to kill a demon here and they not always drop very good loot I tried to get his attention. I'm not sure I will be able to. Oh, there it is. Come on, boy. I will not always run back here. Eventually, I will have to move these turrets inside. I think I have shot that dude in the pools. Oh, the morning is coming. This is good news. Let me move these two inside. And always want to just run around. And I'm pretty sure I'm not alone here. Oh, there's another one. Have picked up something. Okay, we are good. Actually, putting points to stairs was not a bad investment at all. Even though I'm shooting, I'm shooting with the uh, I 
damn, look at that. Didn't even drop anything and I used like two sets of ammunition trying to take that down. What's in here? I heard some walking. I know I can actually, oh I know this. If I would cut those few blocks from there I could get down there immediately towards the loot. But I will not do that yet. I wanted to just explore this PY. Oh, there's some money, in the, I mean weapons there. Oh my god, what's that? I'm gonna need a bigger one. Oh my god. Yeah, I'm bailing. I might come back later, but there's no way in hell I'm not able to beat these guys with my current weaponry. Oh yeah, definitely I will not be able to do that. Sorry turrets, this is, will not happen. Not happen without laser weapons for sure. I thought I'd just come in here and do some POIs, but dang son. This is definitely will not happening. A screamer, that dude with its 30,000 HP. Wait, let me check if I can run him over. Holy hell. And my car is not working either. Oh jeez, instead of running that dude over, he's just killing me through the car. This is horrible. Oh no. <laughs> well, I lost the two turrets. I can't do much about it, but look at that, I have concussion, I have broken bones. Yeah, this is an absolutely horrible place. And the worst part is that I think the whole story of Darkness Falls and, and everything that we need to do, like I, I've seen some other YouTubers trying to go through this and there are some research labs that you need to visit. The ammo for the laser weapons needs uranium and titanium which are both only available in this horrible area. So I don't know. I, I'm a bit conflicted. I'm not even sure what this stuff is. Concussion. Oh my god, wellness permanently reduced by 5. 
Oh, that's not good. Painkillers to cure this. I don't think I have any. Let me check if the drone has any. Uh, no, he doesn't. He has this, but this is my arm, not my leg, so it doesn't help me at all. So, back to base. Damn, I thought I will have a nice video with just me running into that POI and massacring everybody, but... Damn, behemoths, regenerative demons, fireballs flying all around, doing massive damage to me. I'm woefully underprepared for all that. My senses have picked up something. So yeah, for the future of seven days to die, I am not entirely sure how I will do because it, I can hold that little horde base that I have, but in order to progress with the game, I'm gonna need to spend a lot of time in that horrible wasteland area. I might need to go back for my turrets, I just wanted to come back to treat my concussion and other stuff. I thought I'm prepped for it, but damn, I'm, I was not prepped for it. Alright, so, painkiller. Alright. Splint for my arm. Alright. That's good. I'm good with food. And yeah, I wanted to check that red, red page thing. Oh yeah, this is my other car. <laughs> because after my stuff have been duplicated, uh, I've, I've actually got another car and another gyrocopter as well. And this is an inactive demon gate. <laughs> uh, you could actually mine the demon gates in that wasteland and they drop an item which is basically a decoration of an inactive demon gate it's not good for anything it, it shows as an empty damaged demon portal it looks like a, a small container if you have that i'm not even sure if the original ones have this or not but if i touch it and and open that container it will disappear entirely so I just leave that here as decoration. Yeah, um, the car, the car, the car, the car. Yeah, I need to replace this turret here because last time it was uh, smashed by some delinquents. I need to replace some of the spikes and I already replaced some of the concrete blocks under it. Unfortunately, demo, demolition guys will, will shred it every time, so in every horde night I'm having to rebuild the whole bottom section of this, and I have not found any good way to combat that. But yeah, yeah, we will see, we will see. I still have time. I wanted to check that book. And, uh, oops, give me all. I wanted to check that book because that book will unlock laser tech. I really hope that will not just raise my game state because if it just raise my game state, then and that's not good. Then it means that I will be fucked in the horde night. All right, so 10 red pages. And I need for the future is now, not that. Let me check. Uh, where was it? Hmm. Generic book. The future is now, this is it. I need 10 notes, 10 paper, 2 ink, and a quill. 
Uh, I'm pretty sure I not. I, I don't have ink. Let's see what I need for ink. Yeah, so honey, black dye, and egg. Do I have eight eggs? I have six eggs. Not ideal. Oh, I have eight eggs here. Oh, wonderful. Wonderful. I just need honey. And I oh yeah, have black dye. And I think I had black dye. I didn't have black dye, but I have a bunch of items here that are black. And I specifically saved those because they have black dye in them. Oh, well, this one was just a black shoe. I think I need four black dye. Yay. Ink here we come. And I need two. Why do I don't have enough? Mm -hmm. All right, two ink. And I need quill. I've never, I always found quills, but I've never actually checked if I can make them. I can make them. And I only need feather for that. That is smashing. All right, so I have quill, I have red pages. I have, oh, actually I need paper, not those kind of pages. Let's see. Future is now. Oh yeah. What will this teach me, I wonder? Actually, I know what some of the things that it will teach me. Not all. Use. Yes, I feel superbly better. And if you look at this now, I have, I can build laser work, oh shit. I thought I can build this laser workbench. This would have been superbly great to raise the item level. Currently our max item level is, I think, 71. That's the max I can craft. And I have not really seen anything higher than, I think, 60 or something. And this workbench will be needed to, to raise the item level of all our stuff till I think 80 or something like that. But we need forced titanium for it and I have no idea how to get titanium. I'm pretty sure it only appears in that dreadful place. Jeez uh, Louise. All right, anyway, I need to go back for the turrets. So let me quickly throw out everything that I don't need. I will sort out everything later. At a later date. Oh, I keep the gyrocopter. Uh, demonic essence. All right. Well, I'm not sure that this little gun will be enough, but we don't really have any other choice. I try to go stealthy and just get my turrets back. Oh wait. 
I'm, I'm not gonna run into that trap again. I take some of the healing items that help me. Oh, okay. For a sec, I thought I will fall into my own spikes. All right, so healing items. I take some of these. I take this. I take some of that. Actually, one of these, this one, I think it will damage mitigation and rifle damage. Yeah. And yeah, I also take some painkillers. You never know. Because if I go back there and that monstrous bench is still there and I again get KO'd, then it will be horrible. Oh, I also almost forget that I have a... Um, a bedroll down there. That was still a horrible idea. <laughs> we will see how it will go. For the moment, I just want to get my turrets. And then I will figure out. I've got a bad feeling about this. Hmm. The game is a bit sluggish. First I thought I would just go around this food factory here, but that's even bigger than the other one and I didn't want it to spend too much time. I thought that might have been manageable, the, that, that smaller apartment building, but nah. I heard some scream. Slowly. Yeah, it seems that they have moved on. Right. Actually, take up this bedroll here. It's absolutely useless. In case I would die, I don't end up in radiation. I just either have to survive it or something. This is okay against normal zombies, but demons it is absolutely useless and that place is full of them there's no freaking way i will be able to beat that py but i hopefully will be able to get my turrets Yeah, there they are. One of them is already empty. We shoot all its ammunition. And we didn't even gain anything. Anybody home? Oh yeah, that's the behemoth. Oh, that's fantastic news. Can I at least put one of my turrets out? Of course, it's the empty one. Let me put the other one too.
zombie titan. Oof. Alright, if it's just one. Although I said I'm not planning to go through this POI, I might peek in a bit, a bit more. I can always bail if it would be not good enough. Something has awoken. I think it's outside. Oh, that's a lot of noise from outside. Oh, sorry, I just had to check. I'm feeling a bit jumpy. but with reason. Looking for the demonic gentleman. Is he coming? He is not. There's someone behind there. Someone is really trying to take apart things here. Oh yeah, that was it. Oh my god. Fireballs. Bulls of fire. Alright, are you ready, folks? The poo poo is coming. Dude, hmm, tempted. I will not leave these here, but I go for that one. Oh, my, my seventy one turret is almost out of juice. Yeah, first time I was in this wasteland, I was I was straight head run into a horde with all kinds of nasty tentacle monsters. Hmm. Where is that box? And there it is. Oh jeez, you see there's a demon portal. So I need to be careful because where there are demon Master, portals, there are demons too. Actually, I don't see any demon there. I don't see that box either. <laughs> 
All right, so am I blind or what? Where is that drop box? Is it inside here? No. I've seen the smoke just behind this building. But I don't see the box. Look at that. Majestic. Let me check if... It doesn't seem to be like uh, something that I can access or go through. But if I have my ogre... Oh, search. Alright, I got some demonic essence from it. I'm not sure if that's typical or not. This might be a bust. I don't see that dropped crate anywhere. Or I see a nasty demonic Actually, these are just normal zombies. And that bird which is hovering there. But if I'm aiming correctly... I can actually shoot it. That's a tested method. Uh, no matter how hard I look, I don't see anything, and I don't see anything that would scream to me that there's titanium somewhere or uranium, because those are the two things that I will need. Let me check this map. Yeah, I mean, this seems totally undistinguishable from anything and everything. It should be somewhere around this area, but I'll be honest, I don't see any any difference in the dots. Maybe here there's something yellowish. Oh, here's something green. I think that might be uranium. I don't actually research this. So I might be wrong. Let me go there and check. Where is my marker? It's almost a kilometer that way. That's why we have a copter too. Brum brum brum. So I don't need to slog through demon infested wastelands in one piece of loincloth. See, absolutely nothing. Some small POI, but mostly just rubble. It looks totally like a nuclear wasteland. Oh, there's another portal there. Absolutely depressive. This is actually quite around the area where I stopped playing Seven Days to Die last time because this area is so depressive. 
I can hardly find the motivation to come in here and and do anything. Demonic portal. There are quite many of them. Oh, there's a titan down there. All right, this indeed looks like a boulder of some sorts. But before I mine it, I do a little housekeeping around. Namely, I remove the demonic portal before it. Incoming enemies, prepare for conflict. Start summoning all kinds of things for me. Oh, jeez. Demons. All right, time to assemble it. Oh, no, 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 no. No, my boy. That is not happening. I can probably deal like with one of you. Definitely not two or three. My dude. He took his trousers. Alright, so come here, my man. You are running like a rabbit. And I need your attention too. My senses have picked up something. Come on, dude. Don't zigzag. Oh no. I'm out of ammo for my fancy gun. All right, let's quickly wrench this before. Ah, oh, jeez, no. Another batch was just summoned in. Oh no. All right. Some of you need to chill. I don't have the capacity to manage all of you. Alright, one of you can come. Actually, I can put down my almost dead turret too. Do I have any other ammo for it? I do. Oh, 
Oh no. I know. <laughs> and you're burning. Come on. I don't have all day. Actually, I don't have half a day either. Come on, robot. Get the heck out of my shooting line of sight. Please don't summon anything, please don't summon anything, please don't summon anything. Oof. Okay. The summoners have been dealt with. That roaming titan will not help us. But... If I start drilling into this, I'm pretty sure stuff will spawn in. Because they get summoned in by the sound of stuff breaking. Let me pick my stuff, set my copter in the right orientation so I don't need to worry about that alright this should be good enough wait where did I did the digging Oh no, I lost it. It was here maybe, right? Okay, nothing is summoned yet, but I think I've lost the spot, I totally don't recall where was that, sp that spot and I forgot to save it. Let me put these here because I'm pretty sure I will be needing to sort this eventually. I already got 40 raw uranium, which is good. Let me see, was it here? No. Was it here? That sounds like a, a bit of greenish. Still nobody. 
Good. Oh, here. prepared for conflict I don't even know where I came in help help oh there it is was it all taken care of by the turrets? Whatever it was, it was taken care of by the turret, and I appreciate it. I, however, need to save this location, and I give it the camp, and I say... What the heck? Uranium. Actually, I, I'm not sure how much I would need. I couldn't have 2,000. I am pretty sure that's enough for that laser workbench. I had enough of that. Now I just need to find titanium. Oh. Santa Claus left me here a bag. Let's take a look around this map. Maybe I can distinguish something like this somewhere nearby that could tell me that that it's titanium. I will show you. I don't really know how titanium is supposed to look like. Give me one moment. Darkness Force Titanium. Clever people on the internet say that they didn't find it. Good. Somewhere in the wasteland, dig down to bedrock on the burnt forest side of the border and mine into the wasteland. This is when you have hazmat gear, so no armor, so not taking extra precautions. After mining in to the wasteland, I break out a stack or two of dynamite and blow everything up until titanium shows itself. Then I dig up around it, mine through it. Just like iron, lead, nitrate can be found in other biomes, in the wasteland there are titanium, plutonium and uranium. I usually just dig a hole to the bedrock and start digging in a direction till I find some. Just like lead, it can be found surrounding iron vein. You can find it 
fine plutonium, titanium surrounding uranium. So they did tell me that it has somewhere, if I just dig deep down enough, I will find it. I never actually digged deep down enough to see, but let's give it a try. Right now I'm not, not dead yet. Uh, so let's see. Uh, was it this hole? I have so many holes. I'm not sure how deep I should go. I guess this is the death. Jeez, that's a deep mind shift. This was bombastic. Well, that was a freaking lie. And look at that mess over there. Ninety-eight, day of the hort, and I have not found a single titanium. And it seems to me I also lost my turrets. At least I don't see any of them here. I've got a bad feeling about this. Yeah, me too. Bye bye folks. There was another boulder here and another two. I wonder what those are for. I'm definitely not gonna check them out now. My only goal now is to get back to my place because I need to fix it up before the horde. So finding titanium will probably be a task for after the next horde. 
Actually, this was not as horrible as I expected it to be. It seems that uh, even though I was digging with an ogre, nothing seriously bad really found me. And that's not bad. I can come back here after the horde and check out those two boulders to see what they are holding. If they are uranium still, then it's okay. I just need to search for more. But uh, yeah, that needs to be after we prepared sufficiently for the horde. Alright folks, we are coming in hot to our base and uh, I think this will be the prep episode more or less. I have seen, I mean I have shown you a little bit of the wasteland and the awful gameplay this game has over there. And in the next video I will prep this base and clean it up, make sure electricals are working, make sure I have all the turrets I need. And we will see how we will fare during the next horde night. Now that I have the future is now technology, which everything will need titanium and uranium and plutonium and everything. I will definitely will need to go back during the daylight to the wasteland and try to get some titanium. If we manage to do that before the horde then it's fantastic. If not then uh, uh, we just need to survive without it until the next horde night or until I find the necessary ingredients. I wish it would be a bit more specific I mean the darkness force mode about where can I find the resources that I need. Hmm. But anyway, this was the episode. I'm happy that you checked it out. Stay with me till the next one as well, where I will fight the horde, as usually. And I aim to win. <laughs> See you in the next one. Have a nice day, people. Bye-bye.